Hello rainbows, welcome back to my channel. I am here with another clothing haul. So excited. This time I've done things a little bit differently. You guys have seen my many Boohoo clothing fails. Oh my God, I just bent over and I got the biggest wedgie in the entire world. This is like a G-string bodysuit. Like, and it's thick. It's not like a thin G-string, it's like a thick. Oh my God, you will feel this with every step. <laughs> And I figured it's probably about time that I start maybe biting the bullet and spending a little bit more on clothes. <laughs> Normally like I am very cheap when it comes to clothes and the idea of spending like $50 on a single item is just like, oh! and it still is, I guess, because you know, every cent counts, especially when you're not working and yeah. <laughs> Every cent that counts, I'm poor. I decided to do something a little bit different, spend a lot more money than what I normally do, and just see if I can get better quality clothes, better clothes that actually fit me, better, that looks better on my body, and yeah. So, I did quite a bit of shopping online at Maya. Uh, there's no Maya where we live, the closest is like a very long way away, like 700 kilometers away, so all of this stuff I bought online, I didn't get to try on. Uh, I don't really know the brands too well, but a few brands were recommended to me, so I thought, why not just, you know, go for gold? So I'm just gonna dive right in and we'll go from there. We'll start off with this baby anyway. I have already worn, I've already worn two of these dresses because I just love them. I will have the links to them in the description box below because obviously I have taken the tags off them, so I don't quite know what this particular one is. This one is by Taquito. It was like 60 something dollars. Uh, it's a size 14 and it is beautiful. This is the front. It is like a wrap front dress. Oh, I need to grab Hazel. Whoa! Whoa! You just put food all over mummy. Let's wipe your hands down. Yum, 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 yum. <laughs> So it is a kind of plunge in the front. It has a tie around it. And then it's got like this beautiful kind of frill that goes over the arms and then through the back, which just, hey, how are you? <laughs> yeah, yeah, she did. She just woke up, so. So yeah, I am just going to try this one on and show you guys what it looks like. It is so pretty. So I'm just gonna tie it. It's not like a real tie front. It's more of a mock tie front. Like it's all sewn in together. Uh, but this is how it looks like it is kind of plungy this bit does wrap around down here so I guess you could have a pin if you want it a little bit more modest in a way um, but I really like how it looks I really like these parts and it does go you know around the back there I think yeah just shape wise like it's comfortable it's not like grabbing really too much in any areas. I definitely could have got a 16, but I figured, you know, if I lose weight, I still want to be able to wear these, especially because I'm spending so much money on them. Um, yeah, <laughs> I think it's really, really pretty. I really like how they look and yeah. Okay, so this is the next one. I have not worn this one yet. I particularly bought this one because of Crystal Conti. She had it and I loved it on her and just thought it looked absolutely gorgeous. This is from their petite range. <laughs> um, and I'm not petite, so I know petite is like short, but yeah. So this is, this was freaking expensive and I have since seen it on the Maya website for half price and I'm like kicking myself. So this was $89.95. It's ridiculous how expensive this was. I think there's an extra button in here, which is quite cool, but like even just like, you know, the tags, like it's just so much better quality. So this is more of a longer sleeve one. It does cross over. It's got like these frilly kind of details. And then on the skirt part, it's got frilly details as well. I think it just looks beautiful. Uh, so we will try it on and just see what it's like. I have to undo the buttons. Did I? <gasps> I broke the button. Oh my God, I broke a button already. Ah, okay. Me, that is what you get for rushing things, guys. Don't friggin' try and pull it up without. Ugh. Oh God. Oh my God, it's short. Okay, hold on. This is not something you can get into quickly. There's like one button here. Oh gosh, is that even going to do up? Okay, so this is how it looks. Um, <laughs> this button just came undone. Looks. Um, <laughs> So there's a button that like clips in way over here on the inside, which I, I couldn't even do up. I struggled to do it up. Um, oh gosh, this little press stud button, I don't think is like strong enough. 
So I broke one of these side buttons here and I've only done one of them up because it's quite awkward trying to like all the way over here. I think I only just fit into this. This is different material from the other taquito dresses. Um, so yeah, this is, is obviously a taquito dress. This one is more of like a linen-y kind of material where the others are a bit more stretchy and you can just kind of pull on. I do think it's really pretty. It is kind of like whew, getting into the short area, but I think it looks quite nice. I think it's flattering. Yeah, it's really pretty. Just have a look at the mirror behind the camera. Uh, buttons are a pain in the ass, but I think it actually looks quite nice on. I like the color. I think the color works nice with my hair. Um, but yeah, I think it's pretty. It's just not something you can really get into quick and don't try and just like squeeze yourself into it because the buttons will pop off. Can't believe that. Ha! Huh. All right, what is next? Next I have a dress. I can't be bothered getting the chair. I'm just gonna stand up and tell you guys about this dress. So this dress is by Sass. This was on special for like $20, I think, down from, it was clearance to 60, then to 40, and then I got it for 20, I'm pretty sure. I don't know what the original price was. But this is the Amelia tie sleeve wrap dress. Again, it's like a dusty kind of pink. Yeah, so let's just try it on and see what it's like. <laughs> Huh. Oh wow, so it's feeling kind of tight around the arms. Very, very tight. I mean, you can obviously undo that, like here. This, this is not gonna fit, guys. This is a 14. This is the same as the others, but this is not gonna fit. There's like this weird kind of string, which I don't, there's like, there's no hole for this string to go. And then there's this string, and then there's this string. So this string's like meant to attach somewhere in there, which it can't. And then this one ties over here. It's a very pretty color but it is like, like honestly, my whole, my whole chest is out in full view. How, 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 how is your boob meant to fit in this tiny little pocket here? Like, <laughs> how? It is, I guess, nice, but like, I don't know who this dress is made for. Like, it's like gaping in weird spots. My whole chest is showing. It's just, ah, uh, that's just freaking awful. <laughs> Let's put the next dress on and then I'll explain it to you guys. Okay, here we are. So this is the next dress. I actually wore this dress on Christmas day before it got too freaking hot to do anything. So this is by Taquito. It is the exact same material as the first dress. So it is stretchy. It's super comfortable. This is a size 14. Um, it does have like a similar kind of wrap type thing, but it's all like inbuilt. So it's not gonna come apart on you. It's just quite simple, like in at the waist and then out. Oh, postman's here. Hi. Oh, thank you. Yes. I have a package. What is in here? Honestly, it sounds so freaking creepy. Anyway, yeah, I really like it. I think this is a gorgeous dress. It's comfortable. I feel like glamorous in this. I think you could wear this like on the daily, just to whatever, or you could also dress it up to wear out or whatever. So yeah, like it. It's so nice. Um, again, it's freaking expensive. I can't remember how much I paid for it, but it's like, whew. So yeah, I think I brought a blue dress at the same time, but I can't seem to find it. I'm pretty sure I brought it. I don't know, it kind of all blurs into one. Like, did I buy it or didn't I? If I do find it, I, you know, if I did buy it, I'll include it in another clothing hole. Did you shut the door on yourself? Keep the door open, sweetie. Okay, so I have a, another parcel here. It's weird because like most of this stuff I bought in the one order and they came differently, you know, in different bags. Okay, so I got tops. Oh yes, I forgot about these. All right, so I've got a wing sleeve top in white, which I'm pretty sure I just saw this on special on the Maya website, damn it. Oh, it is beautiful. I think it's gonna be friggin' see-through though. It looks see-through, but it just looks gorgeous. This isn't a size 16. Okay, I did up these. I paid $50 for this but it looks beautiful. 
And I am going to try it on with a skirt that I bought to show you guys. Hey, this brand is again Taquito. This brand here is Basque and it is their petite range. I got again a size 16, I think. This skirt just feels beautiful. This is how it looks. It's got a kind of little detail along the front here. It's got two little pleats in the back. Like the quality of this compared to like quality of Boohoo stuff. Is just does not compare in any possible way. Uh, it's got a little zip on the side. It feels freaking heavy. It's kind of scalloped and then it's got like this underlay in here as well. So huh, beautiful. Like it feels like this weighs a few kilos easy. <laughs> so I'm just going to do this button up. I have a dark blue bra on. Sorry guys, I should not be wearing a dark bra with a white top, but hey, God, I hate little buttons at the back. Okay. I'm going to leave that button undone. I'll show you guys the skirt first. I love it. I think it is really, really flattering. I have worn this up quite high, so it's not like super, super tight or anything like that. Um, and it does kind of cover. Obviously, you can wear it lower. You don't have to wear it as high as what I've worn it. But I think it's really pretty. I think it's kind of feminine. It flows. It looks gorgeous. Hazel's in a box. box. And yeah, so with this top, I would probably wear this top like tucked in. And I haven't really done it up at the back, but this top is a 16. It might maybe be a tiny little bit big. It's like very, very roomy up in the top here. Wow, it is massive actually. If I was to kind of do this button up, like it is very flowy and roomy, but that makes it comfortable as well. I didn't want to have anything kind of restrictive underneath the arms. And this is probably as high as what I'd want it to go under here. So I am probably glad I got a 16. I think it's just flattering. It would be nice with jeans. It could be nice with this skirt if I had maybe a belt or something like that to give it like a little bit of an accent in here. Yeah, I think it's beautiful. It sucks that it's now like half price <laughs> and I paid full price, but oh well. It's, yeah, I think it's definitely worth the price even at full price. Material is really nice. It feels light and airy. Last item I got is a not front flutter sleeve top, which I'm guessing is this one. Uh, yeah, this does have the knot at the front. This feels similar, I guess, to the first kind of dress material. I don't normally go for stuff like this. Like, this is completely out of my comfort zone. Uh, this was $60. Shade Tropical Sorbet. So, this is how it looks. It does have, like, this under bit under here, and it ties at the front there. So, I'm guessing you can undo that tie and then wrap it up to whatever kind of shape you want. It doesn't completely untie the top. And this is Taquito, so size 16. Let's try it on. Oh, look at you, cutie pie. This actually looks really nice with my skirt. Surprisingly, look at me go, guys. Look at me go. So I'm just kind of tucking it in. This is how it looks untied. And then the tie parts, like it actually comes all the way from up here, like, <laughs> <laughs> oh my god I'm crazy I'm crazy so I'm guessing you like depending on how small you are you could probably tie it up at the back if you wanted to but as it was shown it was tied at the front so this definitely is I guess more modest I'm gonna pull like this under bit down just so it's not like gaping up here and maybe just tie it like this so I don't really I haven't really seen how it looks yet let me have a look oh I like it so yeah like it would kind of is like gathering a bit weirdly there so I am gonna just undo this maybe if you like just softly drape it or something like that when you tie it instead of tying it like super tight try a loose tie yeah I think that maybe is a like a little bit more flattering I don't know I really like the sleeves I like how they're just like kind of you know scalloped but like they're not harsh or anything like that I think that's really pretty so yeah I think this outfit is quite nice actually it feels strange to be this kind of dressed up because normally at home I'm like in my track pants or in my you know just whatever singlet and shorts I just chuck on because that's you know life I don't really have much cause to dress up these days so for me to like wear this out and about I feel gorgeous in it but I feel like I, it feels strange it feels like I'm all dressed up Especially like because I'm 
in a mining town it's just like hmm <laughs> but yeah I think it's it, this is really really nice I can definitely picture myself wearing this especially going out shopping or whatever going out to lunch oh I need to go to brunch or something oh my gosh can me a puppet can we give me a cuddle oh sorry Mummy's made a big mess. I swear I've got a blue dress somewhere. You guys will probably see it in another video. But yeah, that is my whole, this stuff was not cheap. It was expensive, I'm not gonna lie, but there is no doubt that the quality is like 10 times better. It fits better. These are, these are kind of clothes that would actually last you. So I made sure that I paid a bit more attention to buy things that you know I would continue to wear for quite a while and would be hopefully the right size uh, so I am glad I got the 16 in the tops the 14 in those dresses is definitely good except for that it's sass I mean, what was going on with that I need to send that back because so yeah thank you guys for watching give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it uh, leave me a comment let me know what you guys think this is really different kind of stuff for me I, I mentioned this in my last video like I'm trying to find my new style since having a baby like everything's kind of changed I don't really know like I was kind of wearing what I used to wear before I got pregnant and that obviously wasn't really working for me so I'm trying to find like a new style and I don't really know what that style is so I think I'm kind of getting closer closer to it I think let me know what your thoughts are thank you for watching again I love you I'll see you guys in my next video I'm rambling I'm bleh. <laughs> You're gonna wave to everyone? Bye! Hey, Hazel. Bye! Okay. Doesn't wanna wave.